If you're interested in buying any Sims packs, use my creator code SweetAshGamer when you check out. By using my code, you are directly supporting this channel. Thanks, guys. Thanks to the EA Creator Network for making this video possible. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, or welcome if you're new. I am Sweet Ash Gamer, and today we are going to be playing the newest expansion, Love Struck. I am so excited to finally get into this, so let's go ahead and look at the world real quick. So this is Ciudad Enamorada, and we have quite a few lots. We have this whole section down here, the plaza, and we have four lots on that. We have this section over here, which is the, there it is, the Vista. And we have one, two, three, four, five lots over here. And then we have the city area, the Nuevo Corazon. Corazon. And it has one, two, three, four lots, I believe. Yes, four. So we got four, five, and a four. Oh my gosh, so many freaking lots. This is incredible. Uh, so I want to go ahead and just jump in. I went ahead, I was so excited about the new apartment. So I went ahead and I made a new sim. Her name is Andrea Short. She has the new Aspiration Romantic Explorer. And she also has the new trait, Love Bug. So let's go ahead and get into it and let's look at maybe some of the new furniture and stuff because I'm really excited to check that out. Okay, so here we are at the apartment. Interesting. Oh my gosh, look, there's like rooftop things all around there. That's so cute. This area actually is pretty incredible. I've not looked at it at all. Oh my gosh. Wow, the trees. I love the trees. Okay, so this is probably a gym. Yes. Nice. Okay, this is where we live. And what is this over here? A nightclub? Ooh, that's cool. We got another apartment area over here. Might have to move into this one eventually. That one looks more expensive. All right, let's go ahead and get into here. And I want to look at some of the new furniture stuff. Oh my gosh, this bed. I am so excited for this bed. And the swatches are all so good too. That is so cute. We have so many new beds. Look at this fancy one. I love the flower design on the headboard. Oh my gosh, and it's not there on some of them. That's nice too. Oh my gosh, okay. Those are really nice. And we have a heart bed. Oh my gosh, you guys, finally, the heart bed returns. Although it looks pretty different, I think it still is really nice. Look at that red one. Ooh, and I'm pretty sure it like vibrates and stuff too, which is interesting. Should check that out. We got some new chairs. Oh my gosh, lots of new chairs. Look at all that. Wow, okay, I won't go over everything because I'm sure you guys have already looked at any build buy stuff or whatever that you wanted to in videos that have already come out, but I just wanted to kind of look at some of the stuff because I've not been through it yet. Look at the ottoman. Oh, that's so cute. A new guitar. Oh, that's nice. Ooh, I like that. Oh, we got some really nice swatches for that. That's cool. Looks like we have a new party game. A costume trunk. Oh my. <laughs> We're going to have to play around with that whenever we get ourselves a boyfriend. Uh, there's just all kinds of new stuff here. All the flowers, plants. We got a whole bunch of decor. New pictures and stuff for the walls. That's nice. Wow, I'm actually really, really excited for this pack. I feel like it has a lot of stuff that I'm going to use. And we've not even showed you, like, any of her outfits and stuff. She looks absolutely incredible. So she is wearing all new clothes, jewelry, hair, makeup. You can even see the new eyelashes. Look at that. Ooh, nice she's even got the new tattoo she's got the one on her back as well uh let's go ahead and show her some of her show you some of her other outfits so she's got all kinds of cute outfits 
and the majority of them are all new outfits. The only one that's not is swimwear, and that's because there unfortunately was no new swimwear. But there are so, so many cute outfits. Look at that. New hair as well. Oh my gosh, again with the new jewelry. Still can't see her back. Okay, I'm looking for a outfit in which we can see her back. Look at that. Ooh, so cute. Okay, here we go. There it is. Look at that tattoo. Oh, isn't it so pretty? And the earrings too, the butterfly earrings. I'm actually obsessed with so much from this pack, guys. I'm not going to lie. I feel like it's really worth it. Um, all right, so let's go ahead and get started. I have not done anything. I don't know uh, what any of this is aspiration get to know on a date. So obviously we're going to, going to be going on a whole bunch of dates because she is actually um, a love bug, which means that they are constantly swept up in the whirlwind of romance. They fall in love easily, often wearing their hearts on their sleeves. She's also a party animal, alluring and self-assured. So we're going to get out there. We're going to have tons of fun. I think the first thing that we need to do is join Cupid's Corner. Oh my gosh, this is exciting. First look at Cupid's Corner. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. What is that? Let's... uh. Can we take like, oh, she can actually take a selfie. Hold on, that is actually so cool. Oh my gosh, I love that so much. This is a terrible place to be taking one, but let's just go ahead and take that one. Oh no, that can happen. <laughs> that's terrible. Oh, that's cuter. Perfect, please don't mess it up. Oh. <laughs> let's try again. Got it, okay. Ooh, we are romantically attracted to men interested in woohoo with women or men. Okay, so we are looking for not elders, sorry, young adults or adults. And we can describe ourselves with two of our traits. So I think maybe we shouldn't be so upfront about the party animal thing because that might be a bit of a red flag to some people. So let's tell them that we are self assured and alluring let's leave out the other two because <laughs> though maybe it, they look a little bit negative in some places so let's leave it at that uh andrea let's see looking for matches oh this is so exciting okay kyle <laughs> nah mm, maybe Nah. Ooh, she's pretty, but um, we're not romantically interested in women, so kind of looking for a man. Armando, evil. This trait is a turn on. She likes evil. What? Did she do that herself? All right, well, let's add him to our saved. I don't know what that means. Oh, okay. Remaining number of sims you can interact with today. Three. Total of s number of sims you have in your save tabs. One out of 15. Oh, interesting. Okay. Should we, like, ask to go on a date? Oh, I like all the noises that are happening. Why is she... Why is evil a turn-on for her? How do we check that? get to know you date yes main objective is to complete goals during the get to know you date based on the activities you choose okay maybe sparks will fly or maybe the flames will fizzle out it's time to uncover whether there's potential for romance between your sims by getting to know each other better or maybe your sims are already head over heels and a casual date is just what they need to deepen their bond it's bound to be an unforgettable adventure all right let's go all right, host, date, got it, guests. I don't think we need to invite any extra guests on our date. <laughs> That's a little weird. All right, let's be romantic and friendly. Let's um, probably have some drinks and maybe, maybe we'll dance a little bit if that's, if that's an option, you know? Um, I think also, what else could we do? 
Maybe we could have the expectation of a, a little bit of fun. I think that's good. Select a location. Uh, at my house? No, no, that's a little soon. How about let's go to the nightclub that's downstairs? That sounds fun. All right, here we are. Oh, I'm <laughs> Hi, nice to meet you. I kind of, oh, oh boy. <laughs> this place, hold on, we need the proper experience. Wow. Oh, this is incredible, you guys. The vibe in here. Oh, come on, let's come sit in here. Sit together, please. This is my favorite nightclub. Oh my gosh, I... This is a little interesting to for a nightclub, but... It is really, really... Oh, man, even the bathrooms are nice. What's upstairs? Wow. Oh, it's so nice. And the ba I can't believe that the bathrooms even look good. I love the atmosphere. I think they've got all the, the lights turned to red or something. Yeah. But I love that. I love doing that with my stuff too. Whenever I throw parties for my Sims, I just turn all the, the lights in their house a different color. And I'm like, oh yeah, party. <laughs> but I love that they're doing that now in this nightclub. That looks incredible. Um, I'm kind of ignoring the fact that we're on a date right now. I apologize. He's like, he does not look very happy, to be honest with you. Uh, are we supposed to be like... Pre pres present... <laughs> Why was present so hard for me? I was like, present romantic gift? What? <laughs> present romantic gift. Give, wait, what does that mean? Present it or give it? Present it. I'm gonna present this gift to him. <laughs> what? I don't understand. I just wanna see what the difference is. I don't even know where I got this book, to be honest with you. I think it was from her house, maybe. <laughs> Oh, so it was a romantic thing. Okay. She just got the romantic skill. Relationship. Ask about physical attraction. Whoa, there's so many new... Learn more about romantic boundaries. Ask for attraction level. Explain attraction level. I need your romantic boundaries. Looks aren't everything, but truthfully, I do look out for some physical aspects in a partner. He likes basic fashion in green. Hold on a second. Okay. Uh, turn off black hair and black clothes. Interesting. Okay. Well, I've swapped into my green outfit, so maybe he'll like me a little bit more now or something. Date action. Ask how the date's going. So, how's our date going? What are you thinking? Uh, ask to change venue? Oh, that's interesting. Okay. So, view relationship. Oh, you can just go straight to that. Oh, that's really cool. Wait. Wait, I want to see hers, though. She likes black hair and black clothes. Costumes, rocker, and streetwear. She likes woohoo. Okay. She likes to be argumentative and... She likes argumentative and egotistical sims. That's interesting. She likes performers. Taken. What does that mean? She likes people that are taken? Oh my. And health and sports. So she likes sports boys, too. Are you single? Because apparently she's going to like it a lot more if you are not, sir. I think he is single. He was on that dating site. Yeah. That makes sense, I guess. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so we are crushing this date so far, I think. Ask about change relationship. Ask to be friends. Oh, that's so good that that's just like an option and it doesn't have to be like a negative thing. Because there's been so many situations that I've been in that I've been, like, wanting to date somebody else. But, like, don't want to have a negative relationship with the person that I was previously in. But it kind of ruins your relationship with that person if you break up with them, unfortunately. Can you come over here and sit with him again? Because, uh, you're kind of sitting with these girls at the bar instead. And you should be with your date over here. Whoa! I saw that. 
relationship. Ask about romance style attraction. What? Romance style attraction. He does not like flirting, but he does love gift giving. <laughs> oh, that makes sense. I gave him a present and he was like, oh my gosh, I love you now. That's so funny, but he doesn't like flirting. That's not, uh... Can we, like, cuddle and stuff already? So he likes taking sims, too, and clean sims. Oh. He doesn't like broke, ambitionless, or pet enthusiasts. Okay. Romantic satisfaction begins. Andrea and Armando have a strong romantic relationship and will now each have independent romantic satisfaction levels. High romantic satisfaction will make maintaining romantic relationship easier. Low romantic satisfaction will make maintaining romantic relationship more difficult. Okay, so where do I go to see our... Look at all this information. Oh my gosh. There's so much happening here. Okay, um, we've looked through all that. Look. Okay, physical romance does not trigger jealousy. She's exploring her romantic boundaries. Non-physical romance does not trigger jealousy. Woohoo triggers jealousy. Okay, so she's fine with her partners, like, hugging and kissing, potentially, even other people, but not okay with them having woohoo, which is understandable. I think that that is a good line to draw. Uh, let's see what this says. Uh, Armando's romantic feelings. Unknown attraction level, unknown satisfaction. So do I have to ask him how satisfied he is in the relationship? She's attracted to him. That's good. They have good compatibility. That's interesting. So, but how do I find out, like, my levels of attraction for him? Eh? Ask about... Learn more about... Ooh, ask for attraction level. There we go. Attraction. You're all right, I guess. I don't think anything is particularly wrong with you, at least. Ouch! Ouch, I don't know how I feel about you anymore. That was very mean. Uh, ask about another sim. I don't know anybody else. You know, uh, I'm, I'm a little bit sad right now. I feel like this isn't gonna go anywhere anymore, and honestly, I kind of just want to, like, come, get what I came here for, and, uh, leave, maybe? Because <laughs> I don't like him anymore. Uh, ooh, who is this? Uh, El Elia? Bruce. Laya Cruz. Oh, they're kissing. Oh, they're kissing. Oh, mooches. We tried so hard on this date. That's so sad. He was like, I like girls in green. So we literally changed our outfit and he's still like, well, I don't think there's like particularly anything wrong with you. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Yeah, is there um, like an area here in which that we can end the date? There is, apparently. Venue closet. Where's the venue closet? I'm looking around for a venue closet. Is it right in front of my face and I'm just missing it? Maybe it's upstairs. I'll follow them. Yeah, it's upstairs. Oh, they know exactly where it is. Even though they've never been up here in their lives, they know exactly. Oh, there it is right there. Oh, it's like a little closet. Oh my gosh, you guys. We got closet woohoo. And a new closet, too. Oh my. Oh, the little heart's coming out. I'm actually dying. Look at her face. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, well, I think that that was actually a pretty successful date, so um, I'm going to go ahead and go. Well, that was a date. It was a date, right? Your sim has a little gift in their household for consolation prize. 
Okay, softy brand tissues. Tissues! <laughs> tissues for after our date? Uh, I mean, uh, I was gonna say it was a good date, but arguably, yeah, you're right. It was a terrible date, but it ended it ended in the way that I wanted it to end. Hello, how are you? Oh my gosh. Well, I was interested until I saw the mustache. No offense. <laughs> okay, who all are out here? Hello, who are you? I am going to need to come out here and meet you real quick. We didn't even make it all the way out. <laughs> she saw Umber and a bunch of hearts just started appearing above her head. And it said, Andrea feels instantly attracted to Umber. Oh my gosh. Look at all these girls surrounding him. What is happening? He just must be attractive to everybody. This is hilarious. Can I like flirt with him and stuff? How far can I go this early? Will it let me? Can you guys move? <laughs> you guys are crowding my man. <laughs> oh my gosh. He liked that already. Interesting. Okay. Let's ask him if he wants to go on a date. <laughs> it's only three o'clock. I mean, the first date was a bust. Might as well go on a good one, right? Yeah, it was like, sure. Yeah. What about this one? Whether your sims are rekindling or what? Rekindling an enduring love or experiencing the butterflies of a new romance. Um, I feel like we should actually do like a romantic date for this because she already knows she's attracted to him and everything. We do need to get to know him, but I feel like we should also be romantic. <laughs> All right. No, no more guests. Why does he keep doing that? I have no idea, but... Did it just... Oh, wow. Look at their romance. That's crazy. We need to end that very soon. All right. Let's be romantic. And um, I'm trying to think of where we're going to go now. Because we just did the nightclub, even though it was early in the day on a Sunday. Uh, we are... No. Animal skating. Let's see. Swimming. No. Let's go ahead and go to the new lounge. Hopefully something fun will be there. Well, we ended up at a little lounge, and we're drinking some apple nectar at the bar, getting to know each other. I think that we need to be a little more, like, friendly to him in order to get him to open up, but he accepted the date already, and he has already flirted and stuff with us, so I think that that's a pretty good start. I did just find out that he's married, and while I was like, oh, <laughs> she was like, oh. <laughs> so I think she likes that, although that made me uncomfortable. But he's here, so, you know, it's not entirely my fault. We can first kiss already? He won't even tell us. He won't tell us his preferences, but he's willing to kiss us? Man, that's kind of wild. <laughs> They're so cute. Motel room? We, the motel is nearby? The love motel? Where is it? Oh my gosh, it's right here. We can just uh, rent a room to sleep. Oh, that's actually really cool. Rent a room to woohoo. Why is it more expensive to woohoo? Why is it double the price to woohoo than it, than it is to go to sleep? That's kind of weird. Uh, I think that we've agreed, I believe. Yeah, it appears as though we are actually both going over to the hotel. Hopefully she uses the bathroom while she's in there. Oh my gosh. Wow, you guys. How cool was that? And even the sign lit up. That was so cool. Where are you at now? Because you really, really have to use the bathroom. 
Oh, they're still in there. Okay, sorry, I thought it was over. <laughs> um, where is... I guess we'll have to come over here. Oh, look at this little area here! Wow! Little shops in this area and stuff. Oh, a little parking lot. This is so cool. Wow. I actually really love this area, especially this here. Being able to go in between the buildings and stuff like this and for it to feel so alive. I love that so much. It's actually making me think of a, a couple maps in, in Call of Duty Ghost. <laughs> Anyways. Um, Alright, she's really got to use the bathroom, but she's not quite figured out that she can just walk over here and go to the toilet for some reason. Um, is the date over? We romantically socialize, that's for sure. Um, I actually don't know where he's at, though. Nice hair. Look at these two lovebirds. Aw, a little married couple sitting here watching the stars. I'm obsessed with that. That is so cute. Oh my gosh, Mortimer and Bella are doing the same thing. Oh no, that is so sweet. Oh, sorry, the lights are all on, guys. <laughs> That just ruined the moment, huh? Are you guys... Maybe they're admiring this art right here. Because honestly, beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. No, oh, he's still standing over here in front of the, the hotel. Um, well, I guess we should come back over here and... uh. Hello! <laughs> hey, he's cute. Is he married? Dang. Well... I guess we're not really looking for a long-term partner right now, are we? <laughs> uh, it doesn't really seem like it. This has been a lot of fun so far. Oh, she's getting to know her. Mary Greenberg. Pink hair is so nice. Okay, let's come over here and let's sexy pose with him. Physical intimacy. No, we already did that check out let's go decide how attracted become romantic partners umber is sort of falling for andrea and wants to ask her if she'd like a relationship mm, i guess but it's like not serious or anything you know what i mean <laughs> like like in the same way that you're married and still dating me right because that's going to be annoying if you expect the women to be faithful to you, right? So I think that we're good. That's cute. So sweet. Yay. Okay, uh, I need a drink. <laughs> Order a drink. Order your favorite drink. Let's find out what her favorite drink is. I always love doing this. I don't actually know. Is it completely random? I've not figured it out, but I love doing this. Andrea is a love bug sim. These sims fall in love easily. Yeah, I understand what's going on here. What? No. I'm sorry. Strained? Ouch. Andrea and Umber seem to have hit a rough patch in their romance. Are you serious? We have a strained relationship now because I said no to you moving in with me. I mean, I guess I'll take it. Whatever. She's now neutral to him. Oh, he moved way too fast and completely turned her off. That was crazy. She was like, I agreed to be your girlfriend and that made me very uncomfortable, but now you're pushing it like really far. What's her favorite drink? Sugar cane juice. Okay. But it's just sugar cane juice. Like, that's... What are we sitting at a bar for? Okay. All right. All right. Let me go order... Order a special drink. Oh. Order... I want a sea of fire. That's what I want to drink. Is she like... I mean, I think our day can be over now if we're being honest. Apologies, but like... It's a little awkward now, you know? Like... <laughs> oh, that was cute! I don't know what that was for, but that was really cute. Let's go ahead... Oh, no! You thief! You stole my 
like Drake. I paid ninety dollars for that. Well, anyways, let's uh check our social bunny. That looks different, doesn't it? Slightly different. Let's post about our new outfit. Yay, cute. Okay, um, do we actually have anybody that we can add that we actually want to talk to? Uh, we could be friends with Candy. That would be cool. We need a girlfriend. Um, yeah, we'll leave those off our contact, contact, <laughs> contact list for now because I'm not really that concerned. Uh, why don't you come back in here and just, oh, she decided that she's not working right now. Understood. This guy is actually really cute. Yoltik. I love, I love his hair. The color. And his face. He's actually really a cute sim. Maybe you should go watch his performance. She does like performers. This could be a, a new potential for her. <laughs> We've moved through so many people, but you know what? You've seen, you've seen what's happened. You've been there. It wasn't us. <laughs> Okay, she's just watching the performance. Are they flirting? Look, that's the heart thing I was talking about. That happens whenever a sim sees somebody that they're really, really attracted to, apparently. Can you stop now? Because I kind of want to talk to you. Thank you. Hi. It's nice to meet you. Let's see what she immediately thinks of them. What do you think? Oh, and Bobby. I don't think she thinks anything yet. Relationship. Um, romance. Affection. Flirtation. Can she just immediately kiss his hands? <laughs> I'm just going to be super forward very, very quickly and see what happens. I love your painted nails. Ask if single single got it okay um it doesn't seem as though our romance has worked on this one so uh he it, likes fitness why because you just stretched <laughs> these sims oh my gosh okay I think that I'm going to go ahead and send her home because she is hungry and she's tired. And honestly, she's been here the entire day now. She's been on like three separate dates. So yeah, I think that <laughs> I think it's been a good day. <laughs> I think she's ready to go home. This is so much funnier looking than I expected it to be. <laughs> Can you imagine sleeping through that? <laughs> like a light vibration maybe but like that is shaking the entire bed <laughs> how is she sleeping okay well i guess she is getting a, a good night's sleep that's great for her also did you guys know that the bed has this light lights that you can change on it look at that it like emits a light isn't that cool i kept it on red because it was uh you know, nice, a nice vibe. All right, good morning. So I went ahead and I bought this new blanket, right? Isn't that so cute? And I was thinking I'd invite somebody over to test it out, but unfortunately, uh, I think that we've kind of burned our bridges with those two. So I think we are back to Cupid's Corner again. So let's go ahead and check this out and see if we can't get ourselves somebody to come over and check out this blanket with us. Well, I'm struggling a little bit because most of these are girls, but uh, I suppose that we're not really looking for a romantic date right now, are we? So how about Naomi? She's pretty. Let's go ahead and save her. And let's go ahead and get him out of here. And let's ask Naomi on a date. Hopefully she'll want to come over and hang out. Check out my new blanket. All right. A date with some fun at our house. Perfect. She should be here any minute. 
You can come out here. I just wanted to invite you over to come see my blanket. She should be coming in right here. Ah, here we are. How about we watch the sky together? You want to watch the sky together? That's romantic, right? She's like, yeah, sure. Sounds fun. I keep hear hearing a dog bark. I love that little addition. It makes it a little more realistic. Well, you win some and you lose some. She is not at all interested. So we are going to have to see if we can find somebody else. Um, hmm. Trina's probably not a good idea. Let's just invite Harry over. I, I think that... that Ask Katie that date's already in progress. Let's uh cancel this date. Sorry, it was a terrible date and you knew it. <laughs> She's like, yeah, I was ready to leave. Alright, ask to create a date. I just want you to come over here and check out my freaking new blanket. <laughs> we might end up having to invite Umber or Armando over for a minute, but I kinda wanna see if we can find somebody else to come over, you know? So uh let's do all this stuff right that's not necessary and here yes please come to my house there he is all right hello affection uh declare love publicly <laughs> let's immediately declare our love for him before we even introduce ourselves harry fitzgerald Wait, there's still a girl here. Who is that? Valentina Nadir. Hi. Can I introduce myself to you? Man, she won't let me see her face. Wow. Wait a minute. Woo. Hold on. I need to go find her. Why am I wasting my time with this guy? Hello. Valentina. She is so gorgeous. She's like, oh my gosh, instant attraction. Of course you're instantly attracted to her. Look at her. Oh my gosh. In that freaking outfit? That is adorable. So cute. Let's, uh, oh, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna end this date. <laughs> because I'm kind of interested in asking her on a date. <laughs> I've had so many dates in this episode, but you know what? It's fine because I just, I really want to, you know, get to know everybody and, you know, have a good time. Flirt, check out. You should definitely check her out. Maybe tell her a funny joke and then uh, maybe a flirtatious, flirtatious joke afterwards. She's like, oh. Oh, she liked it. Andrea can now perform seductive dance. Ooh, and tender neck kiss. Umber. Nobody is home. I have a heart bed. No, I can't. I'm playing The Sims. You're what? You would choose that dumb game over me? What a loser. The Sims is not dumb. Umber is cancelled. Let's ask her if she's single. We really don't care, but it's an option, so... Uh, and then we'll first kiss and tender neck kiss. She is married. That was cute. I want to see the tender neck kiss. Whoa. Whoa, she's really going in. <laughs> they have a strong romantic relationship. Yeah, it keeps saying that. But uh, I said that about everybody that she's been with. <laughs> Ask to seductive dance. Can you seductive dance for me? <laughs> what a weird thing to ask somebody first date. Did she say yes? Oh, we're doing it together. <laughs> oh my gosh, it looks like a dance off. Sexy dance off, sexy dance off. <laughs> This is hilarious. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I did not know Sims could move like that. Oh, this is incredible. Are they just gonna keep going? 
Shake, shake, shake. Dance skill acquired. Wow. Are, is there romance going up? It is. The romance is going up from this. They're just shaking their butts. <laughs> Woo! Look at that slow roll. Dang. Dang! <laughs> Why is that so funny to see Sims move like that? I'm laughing so hard that my face hurts. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was the best thing in the world. Okay, now can we please finally come over here and see what this blanket is all about? They are both very satisfied in their relationship. Uh, I'm not interested in woohoo with women. Um, did she say no? No, oh, I just wanted to try the woo blanket. Why won't you let me? Oh, dang it. Okay. I just... Mm. All right. Umbers matter to us now, I think, though. Let's just call over Armando. Just so we can see this blanket in action, you know? All right. He... Oh, I was about to say, he just caught me kissing on Valentina, so he might be upset with me, but yeah, he just said no to Woohoo in the Blanket. Have I really just messed myself up so much? <laughs> Nobody wants to go in the Woohoo Blanket now. Please, just go sit on the blanket. We don't have to do anything. Just sit. We'll just sit and talk, and we'll show everybody how amazing this blanket is. No, thank you. She's a party animal. She's like, actually, I kind of want to go, though. Tease. Ooh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ah. Uh, oh. Oh. Jory Pumba. What new? Uh. Okay, get the heck out of here. I'm done with you now. <laughs> I'm done with you now. You know what, guys? It looks like we are not going to be getting to see this blanket in action this episode. That is so unfortunate, but <laughs> she burned a lot of bridges today. So, you know what? I don't I don't really blame all these people. They're all apparently very jealous people. So, Naomi wanted nothing to do with us, unfortunately. Neither did Yoltik. And Arbondo witnessed us kissing Valentina, who also was not interested in a woohoo relationship. Um, and Umber's also pretty mad at us because we apparently said no to moving in with him after just hours of knowing each other. So. <laughs> Um, I think that there is a little bit of tweaking that probably needs to be done to the game for this pack because, because it does definitely seem like romance is not only happening extremely often, which in some cases is okay, but also it feels like it's a little bit too easy now to be romantic with strangers. Now, we have witnessed this failing, of course, but also... This is just the first episode and I was able to woohoo two people in like very, very early minutes of the episode, you know? So I feel like that there's probably some tweaking that needs to be happening with this, making it a little bit harder for romantic interactions to actually hit. Um, but overall, I'm really enjoying this pack and actually having a lot of fun with it. So if you guys are interested in purchasing it, it is going to be out on the 26th of July, which uh, should be tomorrow. And uh, you can go ahead and go to the EA app or wherever you purchase it and use my EA code SweetAshGamer and that will directly support my channel. So thank you so much if you end up doing that, but I hope you guys did enjoy and I will see you in the next part. Bye.